of us are still in vacation mode. Um. And definitely, it seemed like last week people were in vacation mode. That's what distance learning does. She yeah. lulls us to yeah. sleep. Maybe that's Chromebook. a good thing. Makes me want to go to sleep. We fall asleep any time during the day. How many you maintain a routine during distance learning? I only went to Zoom calls because they did me for like That's a dangerous. How many maintain your same routine? A what? Same routine. Oh, same routine. Get up. Whether you're in school or out of school, your routine is the same. No, no, no. That's what I'm that, saying. Yeah, That's why it throws us for a loop. Okay? Throws us for a loop. Here are our tests. Oh. Oh, no. Although Adriana, you at home, you still need to take this test, so make sure you take it and turn it in. Jameson, Sam, uh -oh. Tommy, oh, no. Lily. Sierra. Holy crap. Yeah, I have no idea what you're doing. Mia. Oh, okay, because I was like... Oh, I know, I didn't care about it. Oh, what? <laughs> what? How do you mistake that? Aerosol. Lucas. It was such a long time. Yeah. Bethel. Let's go, 53. Logan. Oh. Bam. Oh, I bam, bam. Maggie. Oh, I got an 83, too. Woo! Oh, wow, look at it. Oh, uh, 98. I know, it's the same. It's just Nathan. on this side. Great. I got one, two, three, four. Uh, I got that one. Right. Here and here. <laughs> Here's Well, I think Did you get the bonus? No. Well, we got oh, I got the second bonus. Mr. Hill, did you get I wrote it down. Yes, uh, ma'am. In Paris, rich people do go away. Vacation that's yeah, that's every year. That's not a fact about Paris. Oh, it is. Oh. In Paris. Oh, that's a fact about people in Paris. Which are very in Paris. Wait, what's that? Fact about Paris? Mr. Howard, where did you go? I spelled B-S-L-E. Leipzig. 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 L-I-B-Z-I-G. Mr. L, can I get a retest? Please wait until the next Monday. The arms are underneath my donuts over there. Donuts! Russell. Okay, take out your English words quiz. Let's find out how English you are. So the distance learners, you didn't get this sheet because I didn't have it available to post. So you guys did the one that was online. We might practice that one after after this. I definitely I'm most likely American. So it translates. Soccer is sticking plaster. <laughs> no. Subway is biscuits. Subway is biscuit. Subway is. Oh, that's a swingers. Zero. Cheerio. What's Cheerio? Cheerios? Bro, I don't like Cheerios. Hoot. 
football. How do you not like Cheerios? <laughs> Football's gonna be diapers. Like you need honey nut Cheerios. Well, I was just to get. Oh, so pebbles. adhesive tape. Who's confident your answer is correct? Mr. Hill, I. I guess there were six, right? Nobody. I know. Sierra. Let me guess. Yeah, I said sticking plaster. Sticking plaster yeah. is correct. Let's, Let's go. go. Yeah. Plus one. A fender. Who's confident oh, yeah. your answer is correct? Fender. Yeah. yeah. No. Nope. Nope. Okay. Mm -hmm. A fender is a wing. Oh. And okay. Well. Well, was like a plane wing? Well, I said it was a wing. Okay. Bobby pin. Okay. Okay. Two. A bobby pin is a Kirby grip. Kirby grip. Kirby. No, it doesn't. Kirby. Well, it never will. A pitcher, this one should have been easy. Because this one actually has culturally diffused into ours. A jug. A jug. Oh. A jug jug? So, G N O R. A truck. Caravan. A truck is a lorry. Yes. Oh. Really? Pretty American right now. Yep. And six, most people should have got this one. Yeah. Soccer, of course. Is food. Yeah. food. Is football. Yeah, I got one right. Potatoes. Oh, I get to add plus one. I got two. Seven, long distance. You. Is it you? Anyone? So, 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 so long distance there. is a trunk call. I got that right. That makes I no sense. Right. I guess that. I did not get that yeah. right. Why is long distance trunk call? Well, last year we studied railroad lines and we said the big, long Shoot. transcontinental road is called what kind of a line? Trunk. A trunk line. A line. I totally thought of that. 18. Number eight. Chips. Crisps. Okay, chips are crisps. Potato. Crispy potato. Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. mm, crispy chicken fries. Hamburger meat. Not it's called yeah. mince meat. J, mince meat. An elevator is called okay. a lift. Well, obviously. How did I get that wrong? C, a billfold. This is another one that has Napa's culture life. diffused. Yeah, a so wallet. C says lift. Life. Yeah, that's what I was like. Oh, I thought it said life. I don't know what a billfold is. It, it says life. It does say life. It's supposed to say lift. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Typo. Wow. I was right. Yeah, I don't know. My why. typist must have not copied my original. Yeah, I don't know why a raincoat is called life. Yeah. And I put a seat. A raincoat is called a Macintosh. Macintosh. B. I'm from London, guys. A diaper. Called the nappy. It's called a the nappy. State car. Oh, yeah. It just sounded. Yeah. A cookie. Like a uh, biscuit. A biscuit. It's a biscuit. The subway. Z, nappy. It's called the tube. Oh, I said the S. Yeah, that's what I did. Well, like I did N. The garbage can. The garbage can is called the dustbin. Which one is that? M. A drugstore is called a chemist shop. It's called Tommy's House. I. I guess that completely. A lawyer is called a solicitor. Oh. You. Oh, close. A traffic circle. These have become uh, culturally diffused oh, into roundabout. America. Roundabout. 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 Everywhere is they're getting yeah. roundabouts. I actually got that. Many down here in the southern part of the cities. Don't have too many up in the northern part. But there's lots of them down this way. Uh, 20 zero is K not. Mm -hmm. 
And suspenders. C. Suspenders Life. are called Life. braces. Oh. <laughs> what do you put in your teeth? Suspenders? suspenders. Count up the number you got right. Three. Uh, I got 100 out of 200. I mean, I got 200 out of 100. I got five. What five? I looked up. I don't know. Um, Fivers. I got, what was number five? Five is S, a lorry. What's going to say? I got 21 out of 21. Good. Five out of twenty-one. I'm so good. I did everything. I Total didn't fail. Six out. How many got one right? How many got five right? Ten right. Oh, wait. Who has no? Let me count. No one has ten <laughs> right. You use Google Translate for sure. Jameson, how would you use Google Translate from an English word to an English word? I don't know, you can just use oh, the internet. Yes, just look it up. I mean, you just look up English words to translate into American. Anybody have more than 15? I'm not even like stupid. No, I, I, I had 14. I had 10. Well, I had nine. well, here, we have a chance for people to catch the 15. I have some more. Go? You can add to your total. Ooh, who's going to win? Who has 15 right now? Tommy, you have 15? Wait, I'm going to give you the British name. Or saying, you tell me what it means in America. Smashing. Yeah. Smashing day. <laughs> Wait, anyone? 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 Yeah. Smashing good day. Do some smashing gameplay. How about a smashing day? Trader. Don't forget to a like and subscribe. Trader. A plane. Boat trader. A wandering yeah. trader. Yes. Wow. Car He's from London. Yep. Nobody cares about this card. All they do is like. Oh, I'm gonna. Peckish. <laughs> I feel quite peckish around 11 o'clock. Uh, hungry. Yes. I do. Bro, who eats a Cali Patty at 3 a.m.? Peckish? What? Peckish. Oh boy, 3 a.m. You're saying I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm a bit hungry. My wife likes to go pony trekking. Pony riding? Shopping. Well, I can say, I want this, I want that. You know, with my sister. Biking. No, like, your sister just tries to kill me. No, that's, that's my your, brother. That's, that's brother. Your I hate You're trying to read too much into count. this. Biking. Yes. <sighs> yeah, Is this Tony. Is like a built-in dictionary for every language? If I was in London, I might try to let a flat. Why do you want to get a flat for a month or two. A flat. Oh, yeah. oh, oh like yes. RB, go flat. Apartment. Rent an apartment, yes. Oh. Big brain. I need to add more. Big brain is the size of mine. It's a walnut. Or I might. Oh, okay. Okay. Hire a car. Hi. Uber. McDonald's. Hire a car. Hire a car to uh, hit you. Put it above. Hire a car. To hit someone. Hertz is a famous one in our country. What is what is Hertz? Hertz Enterprise. Does anyone know what Hertz Enterprise is? Car rental. Leah. Car rental. Yes. Oh, where'd you get that from, Leah? You would have done the same exact thing. No, I wouldn't. Yeah. You just said, no oh, one would ever do that. Leah. Only Leah. said it. Guys, my Sweets. Sweet. Candy. Candy is right. I told you. It's not even what? That's coming. I'm not even close. I'm at like 10 now. I was engaged. Sorry. I was zoned out. I was busy. Oh, it's got to be more specific. Oh, come on. Both of those answers. I was lazy. Sam, that's the same thing as busy. Close enough. I should get the point. I think all three of us should get the point. I think Logan should get the point. I think I should get the point. I think I should get like 30 points. No, you just said it weird. 
not on time. Oh my gosh. Uh, I was on my phone. Yeah. We say, in America, we say, we go on vacation. What are they saying, Great Britain? We're going to drink tea. Hey, bye. They go on what? A trip? What? That sounds... Vacation. They go on a lift. Wow, lift. That's an no. elevator. No, no. Excursion. We call... We call... Let's pull up. The day itself is usually. Like this Thursday we or this coming Monday we celebrate as a holiday. So they go on holiday. Oh vacation. Yeah, don't I go on a holiday to the Middle East? No. Yeah. Chips. I know. Crispies. No, Britain is chips. What's it here? Oh. Poker. I don't know who was next. Put your hand down off the net. Blue. Yeah. Cheater. <laughs> they call them carriageways. What do we call them? Potatoes. Cars. Carriageways. Roads. More specific. Driveways. Cheater. Highway. More specific. What? What? Oh, I have. Can I? Can I, can I, can I, can I can highway three is a highway. And interstate. Yeah. Cheater. I was about to say that. Turd. I don't even know what an interstate is. The car's bonnet. What? A car's bonnet. The hood. Antenna? Hmm. That was a good try. Hood. Dang it. Well, you all probably don't have a license. A hamper. What kind of hamper? A bin? Basket is correct. Yeah, nubs and noob. Top her off. Uh, beer. More. Please fill her up. What? Uh, fill it up. I'll give you that. That was. Just don't give Logan any points. We call it takeout food. What do they call it? <laughs> they call it take away food. Take away pounds. Here's an easy one the posting box. Mailbox. Mailbox. We got a letter, guys. Windscreen. Where is my whole family died in a car accident? Windshield. Windshield. Tommy's a cheater. Bring someone up. Yes. You have a dictionary book. Cheater. You guys are all cheating. Shut up, Tommy. A bobby. Your trap. Nope, not gonna say anything. Well someone gets it. Taxi. Better. Person, a Bobby. My son is one. Bobby. Oh, I know. Curtain trick. What? What? You already answered. <laughs> Motorcycle? That's my other son. Dang it. <laughs> oh, they both ride motorcycles. Oh. That's, oh, that's cheating. You cheated. A Bobby is a policeman. Oh. In England, what's unusual about England's or in London? What's uh, London's unusual about London's policemen? They don't carry guns. Right? They don't carry guns. They are okay. Oh. Nice. 
So what are they going to do? Petrol. Stop someone? Petrol. What if, they, what if there's a riot at the yes. Capitol? What are they going to yes. do? A budgie. Just burn down, down the whole building? No. In, Everyone in inside England, dies? Burning hot tea. What? Budgie. Nope. <laughs> a budgie. Um, <laughs> some tea. Some of you might have one. We used to have one. Parakeet. Oh. Bungie. Cheating. A road diversion. Bungie gets me flashback. Oh. Uh, what's it called? A break in the road. Intersection. A road diversion. A psychotic break. Oh. Road cones. Nathan's made sense. I hate when I get to a road diversion. A stoplight. A car accident. That's what I was thinking. Just raise yeah. your hand and say stoplight. A car accident yeah. might result in a road diversion. Oh, oh it's a okay. crash. Well, An 80 year old grandma died. Oh. Oh. oh, my God. Road construction. It might result in a road diversion. A delay. A detour. A detour. Oh, oh. Okay. A caravan. Illegal. It's what Tommy drives to the store. The stogie shop. And leaves with more people. Close. A van. Closer. A white van. A school bus. With the words free candy. Cars. Get in the van! Tommy runs a minivan? Nope. Although they would be if they were in Great Britain. They should be right. Can I answer again? No. Oh, wait, what was your question? Jameson. What? I like a pencil. I can permanently embed it in you, you if you like it so much. Oh. Yes, yes, please. Okay. <laughs> what are the I have experience. Uh, I vote yes. Some African <laughs> tribes, they take it right through the nose. And okay, we've heard it off. I vote yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, I vote yes. <laughs> 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 can, can we get a class vote on this? Actually, no. I don't want to know. <laughs> class vote. <laughs> I don't uh, want to know. Do this, 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 do a caravan is a recreational vehicle. Oh no! Like a camper, okay? That's a camper. Now you know more about this one. You probably wouldn't know. Faggots. All the students. Oh wait, I know this. All that was. Three. I would never. I can't make this joke about Tommy. Baggots <laughs> or cigarettes, right? Oh, yeah. Average 14. Uh, Tommy, 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 they drink a lot of tea. They try to talk for a lot. Be quiet, Tommy. Excuse me. What did the reading have to do with? Sierra. The physical landforms. First of all, let's go over the countries that will be on this next test. One, of course, is Great Britain. And Great Britain is kind of the confusing one because it's actually a country made up of countries. Because another name for Great Britain is what? England. The United Kingdom. Not England. England is one of the political divisions. So the official name is the United Kingdom of God. Great Britain, or of Britain and Northern Ireland. So the different political divisions of the United Kingdom are England and Ireland, Ireland, Northern Ireland, Southern Ireland, and what other two? Mexico. Scotland forever. Spain. Scotland. 
great jobs. I, the only more. thing I know that is because I've watched like, Twitch streams when they will be in Hollywood here at Matt no. Volume. Wait, we're we're going 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 Great. And the next great. next person in line to become king, Ireland, king called the Prince of Weber, this country, Italy, Wales, Eastern Ireland. Ireland. Oh. Prince Ali. <laughs> now each of these, okay, each of these political divisions have their own capital, even though the overall capital of Great Britain is what? London. London. London is also the capital of this political division. Yeah, Northern Ireland. And the immortal. I'll show you some slides. Great Britain, England, and the capital, because I went and stayed in Hollywood in Northern Ireland, which is a suburb of the capital of Northern Ireland. Who knows what the capital of Northern Ireland is? Belfast, okay? And then the capital of Scotland is Edinburgh. Yeah. I don't know if I spelled that right, but. And then the capital of Wales is Cardiff. That's really weird. Now, officially, these are not independent countries, okay? This is the independent country. They are political subdivisions of the United Kingdom. Mm -hmm. We're going to watch a video that kind of explains it probably better than I can. That kind of makes no sense. Okay. Cities named earlier. Now, the other countries of Northern Europe. So basically, there's only one country so far of Northern Europe. This one. What's another country of Northern Europe? Ireland. Oh. Norway. Finland. Ireland. Ireland. Called the Republic of Ireland. And its capital is what? Dublin. 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 So Rosemount. Ireland. The reason Rosemount's mascot and our mascot's the what? Irish. What's our mascot? The Celtic. Okay. The Celtics. Colby. Okay, Rosemount, or the Irish, is because the Irish settled this region in the early 1800s, and it's the Irish from the Republic of Ireland, not the Irish from Northern Ireland. Because the Irish from Northern Ireland are officially what? British. British. Although you probably don't want to tell them that. And we'll get into the, the, the conflicts. They have technical okay. okay. Um, so what's another of the northern European countries? Norway. Okay, you have the Scandinavian, which is Norway, Sweden, Finland, and Denmark. Sometimes these are called the Scandinavian countries, although officially Geographically, Scandinavia means it's just named after the peninsula of Scandinavia, which is which two countries? Uh, Norway, Norway and Sweden. Sweden. Okay. Denmark is also a peninsula called the Jutland Peninsula. What's the capital of Norway? Oslo. Oslo. Yep. Capital of Sweden. Stockholm, capital of Finland. Do they like stars? Helsinki. Helsinki. What? I love that name. And the capital of Denmark. Slinky. Oh, Scooby from Scooby Doo. Denny's. There's a chewing tobacco named after this guy. Oh, yeah, because we're not chewing tobacco. <laughs> yeah. No, <laughs> wow. Oh. Don't ask how we know this. What is it? It's not even right. India. Copenhagen. Copenhagen. Oh, yeah. 
That's how you pronounce it. Yeah. Chewing tobacco is called Copenhagen. Oh. How would I know that? Because people in Nebraska tend to do that in rural areas. Yeah, I know. Um, yeah, I do it. My brothers do. Yeah, it's a no, disgusting over, habit. Like crazy it rots your man. teeth and get, can give you gum Literally. cancer. Oh my gosh. Oh. You don't want the cancer. Yeah. You'll get cancer if you yeah. eat yeah. all yeah. the yeah. 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 Spider-Man will do it. Yeah. 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 The last yeah. country. Yeah. Iceland. Yeah. Is Iceland. Yeah, and it's really green. Look, it's Poland. Is in and it's capital. Oh, uh, polar bear. It's the one most difficult to spell. Let's see if I... I'm going to guess. Great. Anybody have their book yeah. out? Did I spell it right? Reykjavik. 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 No, no, no. Reykjavik. Yeah. Look at the top. Bang, bang, bang. You can look over here. I spell it right. Wait, is Iceland another thing? Well, nobody cares about Iceland. I mean, yes, thanks. R-E-Y-K-J-A-V-I-K. Yeah. Yes! You have to spell it right on the test. Yes, if I can spell it right on the board, you have to spell it right on the test. Oh, I can't make any promises. No, it has to be close enough. I can recognize that you at least sounded it out. Okay. Okay, I think I can. So these are the countries and capitals you need to know. Speaking of which, as soon as we get our achievement project in, we're going to get our uh, first math. No. Project. No. Where you're making a map of all of Europe. Settlement? I think I'm going to be. So you can study them all because yeah. we need to have a test of all the countries of Europe. Right? Yeah. 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 All right. Also, not Germany. Do you know that test? Yeah. I don't want to. I'll give you guys a few minutes. I'll let you teach about Poland when we get there. Okay. So. Dibs on Italy. Why? What characterizes these northern countries? Nobody can understand. Ireland has an interesting, interesting name. Okay, yeah, Ireland, very Ireland has potatoes. Potatoes. Iceland potatoes. I'm not saying specific details about the countries. Ireland has a lot you read a section which talked about the physical yeah, geography and the climate of northern Europe. Or you were supposed to, judging from uh, after the test, where I saw nobody really doing that except uh, I think I saw Ariam do it. I did it. Ariam, we okay. you. Come back. Iceland isn't actually up. Oh. Thank you. So this could have something to do with some of your scores. Now, on an open note test, you would expect, I would expect all of the scores to be substantially what? Higher. And they were Much higher. Okay. Big. Again, this is you guys making the choice. They were surprisingly pretty good. Right now, you're setting the habit patterns you're going to carry over into high school. So it's not about the score die. you got on the test. Okay? It's not about your average in social studies. It's about the habit patterns that will make you successful next year. And right now, some of you are developing bad habit patterns that are going to make you unsuccessful. There will be some teachers next year will say, tough, you didn't have it in on time, that's a zero. Good for you. You can pretty much be sure if you bomb a test next year, what? You ain't getting the retest. That's the grade. Okay, that's why you need to start making some good habit patterns. What's going to make you successful next year? We're trying to give you some tools to do that. Okay? But it always falls back to who? Me. Your choice. Whether you use those tools. Okay? This is one of the tools. Take notes. Research shows if I write it down, what? It sticks better. If I write things down, it sticks better. And then if I write it down and then before tests, if I do what? Go back over them again. It sticks even better. I remember that stuff. Now, let's look at specific, I want to look at Great Britain. You can see that the C is very important to all of these countries. 
And we're going to look out. The sea is important to Great Britain. What makes the sea and we're talking about the ocean over here, the Atlantic Ocean, okay? And in between Britain and the rest of them, you have the what sea? Uh, what's this sea right here? The Atlantic. Atlantic's over here. What's this sea right here? The North Sea. Okay? And then you have the Baltic Sea up here. In between Britain and the rest of Europe, you have the English Channel, which is a narrow inlet of water. It still is, it, you can barely see across it, but some people have actually swam across. And there is a tunnel all the way underneath. You get some from. So you can ride. You can ride on the train from Great Britain into France underwater. If you're not freaked out by that. They're probably going to make some movie now about how the, the uh, they call it the channel. So, what makes the sea so important to Great Britain? Okay, one is for shipping. Historically and continually, Britain has one of the, have, have always been famous for their ship and their, we can, we can say Navy, Navy or military. And tied in with that, we could say defense. How is the sea a defense? It's harder to invade. It's harder to invade a place. The last time England was successfully invaded, anybody know? Nazi Germany. 1966. Nazi Germany did not invade. Hitler thought he could just do what? Swim. Next thing you know, now Hitler's dead. He thought he could defeat Britain by what? Bombing them. Bombing them. Just bombing them. He didn't. The Luftwaffe. He didn't expect to resolve with the British people to stick with it. Well, Hitler never made the to live in the subways and stuff. Okay? But he wasn't willing to risk a, an invasion. That would be too risky. Well, Hitler was scared. He should make a stab people were kill him. Last time England was successfully yeah. invaded was 1066. The Battle of Hastings. We'll talk about that when we talk about Northern Ireland because they celebrated because that's when they put a Protestant on the throne over a Catholic. William of Orange, who came from Normandy, okay, was a Protestant. And that's where we begin to have struggles between Protestants and Catholics, particularly in Ireland, Northern Ireland. Okay, why else is the sea important? Water. Fishing. Resources. Okay. Fishing, resources in terms of oil. This is the one place Britain has oil, is in the North Sea. Otherwise, Britain lacks resources, except for one that they started the industrial resource or industrial revolution on. What resource did Britain have? A lot of. Steel. And now people don't want to use it because it's too polluting. Coal. 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 Okay, so they had a lot of coal, and the other thing about coal is it's a non-renewable resource, which means what? Eventually, you're gonna run out. Okay, you run out of it, and it pollutes so much. Plus, that there are different types of coal, and the British coal is more polluting than other types. What else? Without this, Britain wouldn't, wouldn't be Tea. such a huge... You look how tiny Britain is. Erosion. But its history is what? Big. Back, the saying is, 
the sun, at one time, the sun never sets on the British Empire. Why, where would that saying come from? The sun never sets on the British Empire. Because it's so big, the sun's always on part of it. So some, sometimes, somewhere in the world, because Britain one time had dominated the whole world. Britain has colonies, or at one time had colonies, all over the world. We know the United States is what? A colony. Was one time a British colony. A big part of it was. Yeah, but then we threw that okay. in the ocean. And now you know. Now it's 20. So, how can that tiny country have such a powerful impact around the world in a country without any resources? Today, it's one of the wealthiest countries in Europe. In fact, they don't even need to be. They voted to be out of what? The European Union. The European Union. How are they able to do that? Same way when we get to Asia and study Japan, it's very similar. Japan is a tiny, tiny country, very similar to Great Britain. Okay, but it's one of the wealthiest countries in the world. What enables them to be that? And it's tied in with the shipping. Okay. The sea, without the sea, probably trade wouldn't have excelled so much. Nowadays it could because of jets, but but most even even then most trade that happens today is through shipping through the sea. Why? Because it's easier and cheaper. And cheaper because you can carry a lot more stuff. Mm. And then there's one other important one. They have pictures in our paper. What does the sea have to do with the climate? It never snows. Okay, rarely does it snow. Because. What kind of climate do they have then? Mediterranean. It's what most people missed on West Central. Marine, Island. marine, okay. marine. What's a marine climate like? Rainy. Old okay, wet. one, it's very wet, so it rains a lot. But the temperature, so usually when you look at climate, you look at moisture and you look at temperature. So a marine climate, there's Lots of moisture. What's the temperature? Warm. Temperatures are mild all throughout the year. So again, it's like Mediterranean, like they're in the 70s most of the year. But most people, if they had to choose between marine and Mediterranean, they choose what? Mediterranean. Why? It's not raining. wet. It's not wet. It's not raining all the time. So in the Mediterranean climate, you know, they would have maybe 300 days of sunshine. In a marine climate, you have 300 days of rain. So I'll show you some slides when we went to Northern Ireland, even, because they faced that. But we were very fortunate, we were blessed, because we had seven days of sunshine in a row. That's like a rarity. Till the day we had to move all our tents and it poured that whole day. Okay. So these, without the sea, you could argue without the sea, what? It wouldn't be so much. Great Britain would not be so great. Just be okay. It wouldn't have dominated the world. But the sea. The sea, the marine climate, why do they have the marine climate? Let's talk about that. Let's we'll review that. Warm air. The water cycle. Because water. Remember, down here at the equator, which makes you have currents that come up 
They sweep around like this. What current is that called? North Atlantic Drift. The North Atlantic Drift. It's bringing this warmer water. And when the winds blow across, okay, it's bringing warmer temperatures. But again, water takes a long time for what? Yeah. To heat up and cool down. So my children, it was July, they said, we're up here in Northern Ireland, let's go jump up into the ocean here. No, it's be cold. It's worse than jumping into Lake Superior. I hate lakes. How many of you Lake have Superior tried to jump in Lake Superior in July? I had a friend of mine do it. Okay. Some people jump in Lake Superior now. I Those are the crazy. Yeah. But they have wetsuits that are insulated and warm. But even if, if you jump in, in, in the, it's because it's taken a long time for that water to what? Heat, heat up. To heat back up. And it's never going to heat up as quick as a smaller body of water. My wife just got back from Colombia and they went swimming in the ocean there. Now Colombia is what? So she was right out here. Uh, our Katinga on the coast, I believe. So that's what? Warm. They're right on the equator. It's warm all the time. She says 90 degrees every day. Sure would. So that water is always wet. Yeah. Hot, she says, like taking a bath. The swimming pools, you don't have to heat them, you get in the swimming pools that, like you're in the hot tub. That's kind of, wouldn't that be kind of disappointing? Yeah, that, wouldn't that be annoying? Some people like what? Hot water. Hot stuff. Of course, a lot of people like it a lot more when you go from Minnesota to that. That's why some of you take vacations down south. How many take vacations? <coughs> yeah. It's not fun to get to leave the city. I'm just sort of oh, my mom. Oh, yeah, my mom goes to Florida without anyone else. Okay, in your planners, write this assignment. We're going to watch a video on Great Britain. But write down. Yourself in a suitcase. Read 338 to 342. Just pack yourself in a suitcase. Maybe I, I need to actually assign questions. No, uh, you're just not. It's, all, it's all, right. all good, Mr. Bell. You don't have to. Yeah. Like, it'll just save your time. It's fine. Mr. Sure, Hale, have you forgotten what the page? command? Maybe I'll do an exercise after the fact to see if Three, it's three. Oh, yeah. eight, oh, three, three. Three, three. That'd be fair, wouldn't it? No. Okay. Yes. It was. Oh, we just feel like class. two questions. Hill, when we get that age, I'm going to take a field trip to Japan. I want to take a field trip to Japan so I can eat ramen. You can parachute in. I want to take a field trip to Japan. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't have to take a field trip to Japan to eat ramen, Lucas. Yeah, but I want the good ramen. Sir Winston The better ramen. Hill. I want to go to wow. get the better ramen at shops here. I want to go to the Middle East where I can eat I don't know. Can I go to North Korea? Let's go to the Korean side of the food. Uh, no, we can't. Just drop me off in the sky. Do you want to come to the Middle East with me? No. 